Hi everyone, what is the value of this mathematical expression? This math problem has gone viral and it has received millions of comments on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube and other social media sites. In this video, I am going to present the correct answer. The problem is an expression of order of operations. It is commonly referred to as PEMDAS or you can even say that it is BODMAS. PEMDAS or BODMAS. This refers to evaluate parentheses or brackets first, then exponents or orders, then multiplications and divisions, and finally additions and subtractions. So parentheses and brackets are same, exponents or orders, multiplications, divisions, and additions or subtractions. If there are two operations of the same precedence, like multiplication, division, or addition, subtractions, uh, then you have to evaluate them from left to right. From left to right. The first step of the problem has no controversy. So we're going to solve that. This expression contains a parenthetical expression, which must be evaluated first. 1 plus 2 is inside the parenthesis. So, we'll evaluate 1 plus 2 to get 3. So, we have 6 divided by 2. Parenthesis, 1 plus 2 is 3. Now, the question is what to do next if you input this into Google or any other scientific calculator. The thing that's going to happen next is all of these will interpret the parenthesis as an implicit multiplication. So, this two parentheses three will be converted to two times three. Now, we're going to continue with the order of operations. This expression only contains multiplication and division. So, it's like six divided by two times three. The parentheses is converted into multiplication these are operators of equal precedence division and multiplication so we evaluate from left to right so when we evaluate from left to right we have this 6 divided by 2 so starting on the left we have 6 divided by 2 which is equal to 3 and then we have 3 times 3 which is equal to 9 so the one final multiplication is equal to 9 that gets us to the correct answer of 9 that's according to the modern usage of order of operations so why did the problem cause so much controversy well there's another answer from historical perspective so I actually found some documentation that the order of operations did have slightly different understanding in certain texts in 1917 or before so the first part is same as before 1 plus 2 can be written as 3 6 divided by 2 times 1 plus 2 is 3 the debate that comes around is the division symbol so what is 6 divided by 2 parenthesis 3 equals to well there were textbooks a lot of uh, usage that if you had something on the left divided by something on the right left divided by something on the right this was understood to me that you want to divide the entire product on the left with the entire product on the right that's a special rule that what's that special rule is the entire product on the left is divided by the entire product on the right so for example if a textbook wrote something like this x divided by 2y so that's equal to x over the product of the denominator that's parenthesis 2y so under this special usage which is an exception to the order of operations and we don't use it anymore so applying this rule what happens is you have 6 divided by 
2 multiplied by 3 is the product of complete denominator. Now, which is equal to 6 divided by 2 times 3 is equal to 6 divided by 6, which is equal to 1. Now, this is equal to 1. Many people argue that 1 is the correct answer. And there's some historical justification because of the way the division symbol is used. It's just because of the historical artifacts. You don't need to rewrite the numbers over the denominator. And that will take a block of vertical space. And also you need to keep the parentheses everywhere. So we don't use it today because it can't be confusing. We don't use it today. Instead, we follow the order of operations. So the correct answer is 9. But there's some historical justification for 1 as well. But it's not how we interpret the problem today. Did you get the correct answer of 9? So if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Take care.